New at six, imagine walking two miles to get your prescription filled. That's what one Rochester woman says she will have to do if Walgreens closes its West Main Street store. News 10 NBC's Antonina Tortorello has been looking into how City Hall is trying to fight the closure. Mayor Malik Evans wrote the Walgreens CEO a letter listing all of the reasons why he believes they should not close this store on West Main Street. Here it is. The mayor says this will send the southwest side of Rochester into a, quote, medical desert, particularly for those who live nearby and may not have transportation to stores further away. His concern is also Kimberly McCann's. She tells me she visits this store every other day. Will you have to travel somewhere else or what? Um, yes, I probably have to travel all the way to Monroe Avenue. It makes me feel terrible because I don't have a car and I'll have to walk. Monroe Ave is the closest Walgreens to the one that's set to close. It's about two miles away, which for McCann will take two hours round trip on foot. I will let them know that don't forget about the little people out here that needs this, this store. Yeah. Practically the community needs the store. We reached out to Walgreens and they say, quote, we are making substantial changes to our store footprint, closing stores based on profitability, including this store in Rochester, which are not able to cover the cost associated with rent, staffing and supply needs. While it is not an easy decision to close a store, we will work to minimize customer disruptions. The announcement to close this store comes less than two years after Walgreens decision to close its other store on Thurston Road, which was the only other drug store in the 19th Ward. Reporting on West Main Street in Rochester, Antonina Tortorello, News 10, NBC.